Well, I would say, uh, you know, we did a good job of getting them uh, behind the chains. Uh, we did a good job on first down. We had them in some second long situations. We had them in some third and long mm -hmm. situations. Uh, we weren't able to get them off the field on third or fourth down, which uh, obviously we got to do a better job on that. Um, so I thought it was good that we got an extended drive. Um, I think it's good for our guys to be out there, kind of feel that. Um, obviously, um, you know, I would say Josh, who does an excellent job uh, with the Raiders, you know, they were pretty basic. We were pretty basic. It was a lot of fundamentals and techniques. So, you know, and uh, again, that's what we're striving for on defense. We got to be more consistent with our fundamentals and techniques. And if we'd have done that, then we'd have been able to get off the field and those drives, you know, that drive wouldn't have lasted as long. And um, basically, those are the kind of the things that came up for us is really kind of fundamentals and techniques. Uh, within the drive that, that we could have done a better job. And you got most of the starters in, but obviously two key ones in X and, and not, not there. So, um, I mean, just how vital are they to that component of the defense uh, working together? Well, you'd like to have all your players available, um, but, you know, like things happen from week to week. So, like, we, we've got to be ready to go with whoever is up. Uh, and, um, you know, we feel good about the guys we have. And, um, you know, there were there was plenty of examples of, of good things that happened uh, last night. And there's plenty of examples of things that we could do a little bit better. And I think that's the beauty of uh, training, training camp is really to kind of strive for consistency. So we're really ready to go September 11th. And uh, we got a great opportunity this week in front of us. Uh, we got um, one day to practice against our offense. And then we got uh, Philadelphia coming into town. Uh, for two days with them, and I think the, the, the process and the thought will be the same, is, um, you know, work on really our fundamentals and techniques, and then obviously we'll get to do a little bit more scheme-oriented stuff uh, out here at practice. Coach, last night, uh, Coach McDaniel had said that the Raiders defensively weren't matching Miami's offensive personnel. Mm -hmm. I have an expert here. I just wanted to ask, what, what's the benefit of not matching versus crew? Um, well, again, it could be something you could throw it in as a change up. It could be something that you do on a regular basis. Uh, there's obviously, um, you know, some thought process to be bigger versus smaller groups. Like, for example, if they're an 11 personnel to be in a base defense, if you feel good about your adjustments and your matchups, um, then obviously that's a harder group to run against. Uh, and then some people, they prefer to be in like a nickel or call it a big nickel three safety package versus all groups. So, and again, I think the element of like as coaches, we're creatures of habit. So you kind of study what people do and have done. And if, you know, they throw you a, a change up or a curveball there, you got you got to be ready to adjust as it, as it comes. So do you ever 